friends, wizards, witches, and muggles. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing really well. Today, we are going to be taking a first look at some brand new Harry Potter products. I ordered these from the Harry Potter shop website online. This is an exclusive collection to their website. I don't know if it's available in the Warner Brothers Studio Tour in London. I've not been for a while, but I would imagine it might be. But either way, this is to celebrate the opening of Warner Brothers Studio Tour Tokyo in Japan. I'm very excited it opens this year. I feel like I need to book some flights to go because I've been following along the journey of them building this place, a brand new studio tour over on Instagram and it looks incredible. There are definitely some differences to the one in London so I'm going to need to take a trip but today we're going to be looking at some of the Yumi collection which is anime style. I ordered a few little bits and bobs. I didn't order everything because there's so much like when you search this collection on the Harry Potter shop, there's like 44 different SKUs of product, different different types of product, different characters, different sets, and there's a lot. So I just chose what spoke to me. So if you would like a little first look at some of this Yumi collection from the Harry Potter shop to celebrate the Warner Brothers Studio Tour Tokyo, keep on watching. And hey, if you are brand new here, firstly, hello, welcome. Don't forget that you can click the subscribe button if you'd like to become part of our weird, magical online family. But let's go, because... It's been a while since I've ordered from the Harry Potter shop online. All right, here we have the box. It's, pr it's pretty heavy and it is fragile because I know that there's some glasses and I think I ordered a mug. The style of this stuff is really, really cool. Let me just open it. We're in. Ooh, this box is full. <laughs> Let me put this to one side and just tell you what I ordered from this collection. I got the Yumi Hermione Granger mug on its own, which was £12. Then there was the Yumi Hogwarts student notebook set, which was also £12. I believe you get maybe four or five notebooks. Then I got the Severus Snape gift set, which was £28. Then I got the Harry Potter gift set, which is probably one of the bigger gift sets out of this entire collection, and that costs £65. So that is what we're going to be looking at today. I'm going to do a lucky dip and just pick something out. Ooh, okay, so we're going to start off with a notebook. Okay, so here it is. This is the... Yumi Harry Potter notebook, which I believe came in the gift set. And here it is. Oh, it's got foiling on it. I'm just going to take this little sleeve off. I actually really like the designs of the anime style Harry Potter stuff. Like, look at Hedwig. <laughs> I think it's really sweet. I like that it looks painted as well. I like the colours. They're nice and soft. I love the floral. Oh my god, I've just noticed that Forks, the phoenix, is on this notebook as well. And yeah, I like the floral aesthetic. We've got golden snitches in here. There is a lot of detail and if you pay attention to it, it's really, really nice. Like there's some feathers here. There's the golden snitch I mentioned. Some beautiful flowers which almost look like peonies really really pretty but yeah i love the foiling as well so let's open this notebook up i've not opened it yet so i don't know what is inside but usually they yep they, there's normally print oh that's so cute we've got a golden snitch and a little head wig <laughs> that's really really sweet and then when you open it on up it is just a really nice lined notebook and it does have some kind of patterning at the top as well and the edges are actually gold printed, like sprayed on there. So that's really cool. You do also have a little ribbon bookmark in there as well. And it's the same on the back. So that is the Harry Potter notebook. We also have foiling of all of the house crests at the back as well. But yeah, overall, lovely notebook. You guys know that I'm a big fan of stationery and it's a really nice style. Next up is something in this collection, which they have quite a few of. And these are fans to fan yourself and these are really beautiful like japanese style fans and they're made out of wood and this the actual fan itself is going to be made out of material and i can't wait to see this <laughs> um oh it actually has a case for it as well so this is a harry potter hand fan let's just open it and see what it's about first things first let's talk about the fan 
case. This feels quite nice and smooth and silky. It's definitely not silk, but it feels really nice. And yeah, your fan will go into the little case like so. We also have a little Hogwarts house tag on here too. But yeah, very similar design to the notebook. We've got forks on one of the sides and then it's just floral Harry Potter with a golden snitch on the other side, but that's really cute. I didn't actually know that this fan came with a case. So the fan itself, let me just take this tiny little piece of paper off. Um, it actually has gold foiling written on the side, Harry Potter, because you can get different character ones of these. There's a tassel on the end in this the same powder blue, and on the other side, it does have the kind of trademark stuff. I know that they need to have that stuff on there, but it does ruin the aesthetic and magic for me. Either way, let's open this fan up and see. I love the ribbon as well. See what it looks like. Okay. Um, oh, <laughs> okay. Oh, that's satisfying. That's really satisfying. Oh, oh, that's so pretty. So this is the fan fully opened. And I've got to say, it's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> it's really, really pretty. Um, you can see the back of it here, but obviously the main artwork is on the front. And it is Harry and Hedwig. And <sighs> I'm actually really enjoying this because my studio today is rather warm. <laughs> That's really nice. This is something that would be perfect to take on holiday with you, especially around like the Wizarding World Park at Universal Studios, because then you can just fold it away, put it into your little fan holder, like so, and then you can put it in your bag. Like it's a nice small fan. That's really cool. <laughs> This is gonna be so useful in the summer. A lot of these things in here are packaged in like mystery blind boxes. So this may not be from the Harry Potter set, but I will let you know where each piece is meant to be. But let's open one of the mystery boxes. I'm assuming this is going to be one of the mugs or I think I ordered, mm, no, it must be one of the mugs. Okay, let's see which one it is. So I think this is either gonna be Harry, Hermione or Snape. And I really liked the shape of these. This is the Hermione mug, which is the one that I ordered individually for 12 pounds. Oh, it's gorgeous. I love the shape of these. This is absolutely beautiful. So here's the mug. You can see that there is gold around the lip of the mug. And there's also, I'm not really sure what these, they, they remind me of constellations, which is what drew me to these mugs in the first place. But yes, we have anime style Hermione surrounded by a load of beautiful flowers. And then if you turn the mug round, <laughs> You have Crookshanks, which I think is really, really cute. Um, oh, I think that's adorable. But yes, this is in a pastel pink, which is nice. And yeah, I just really like these and I definitely wanted a few of these. That's why I've got the Harry, Snape and Hermione one. So I have like a little bit of a set, but they're all different because they're completely different colors. Really do like that mug and <laughs> just laughing at Crookshanks, who's just sat in a bush full of flowers looking really miserable. Like they've been hit in the face with a frying pan, to be fair. <laughs> but yes, super cute. Oh, adorable. Let's take a look at some of the other mugs then. Which one is this going to be? Drum roll, please. Snape. I will say all of their stuff is packaged very well. Oh, this is a black mug. It's still got the beautiful gold detailing around the lip of the mug. We've also got a little serpent. I don't even see that. A little serpent climbing up the decorative detailing around the mug. Um, I think there's probably two of those. Yep, there's one on the other side as well. Oh, don't get emotional. That's really sweet that they've just surrounded him by lilies. There is Snape with a cauldron and potions and yes he is surrounded by lily flowers all around the mug um i think that's really lovely the shapes are consistent with these mugs even though the designs and the colors 
are different for each character. The aesthetic of the illustrations and the mug shape remain consistent, so they kind of still do all go together. Had to get something Alan Rickman from this collection. Let's continue with the mugs. I think this is the final mug, and this should be Harry from the Harry Potter gift set, which we started to look at. So here is the Harry one, exactly the same style as the notebook and the fan, um, but I really think it's a really pretty colour for a mug for a start, powder blue. And then we turn it, we've got Golden Snitch, we've got some beautiful golden detailing up here, and then when we turn it around we have a beautiful Forks the Phoenix, just chilling in the flowers. It looks to be like some thistles down here, peonies, daisies, there's just a lot of stuff going on. I think that's really, really cute. I like that a lot. And I think as a trio of mugs, like how good do they look together? I think that's really cool. There you go, I can actually spin you to show the characters. I think they're really nice. They're gonna look lovely in my kitchen. Might even hang them on my mug tree. Right, let's continue then. So I do believe that this is the notebook set which I ordered and there are five in here. These are a nice little, I think they're A6 maybe? But yes, this is the front. We've got another Harry. So this notebook set, they are a lot smaller than the notebook that you'd get in say the Harry Potter gift set, but it's because you get more of them. So let's take a look. First up, we have Harry and Hedwig, and then on the back, it's just powder blue, and then it has these symbols. We then have Draco Malfoy, and he's got some serpents in the background, and he's in his Slytherin uniform. I've just noticed when you open these, there's a little golden snitch on the first page. So here we have Hermione, which is so cute. Also, can we just talk about the time turner? That's so cute, and obviously she is holding a school book because she loves to study, and yeah, all of the flowers and yeah, I really like this style. I didn't think it would be very me, but I do actually quite like it. Next up, we have got Luna. We've got Luna Lovegood in all Ravenclaw colours. She's got her radish or dirigible plum earrings, whichever you think they are. And this looks to be her Patronus, which is sat upon her. And again, beautiful foliage in the background too. I really like that. That's really cute. And then last but not least, who have we got? Ronald Weasley. How do, yeah, we have Ronald Weasley um, and Scabbers in the bottom. Um, there's not much Ronald in this collection, um, which I noticed, which I thought was a bit unusual. But yeah, there's not too much Ronald going on in the Yumi collection that I could see. Either way, that is five little A6, if I'm correct, notebooks. And I think they're all really cute. They're a really nice size for a bag, actually. Like, this is a perfect size notebook for a bag if you need to be out and about with a pen. I don't know. Whatever situations you find yourself in needing to write notes. But lovely size. I think they're really sweet. Really do like the artwork of them. But yes, this is a full notebook set. So it was £12 for all five designs of the notebook, which I don't think is too bad for five notebooks. Next, we've got some more mystery boxes. We've got some white boxes. I think these might be some of the glasses. Yes, okay. So I think we should have a Snape one of these and a Harry one of these, because I bought the little gift sets. Oh, these are gonna be beautiful in the summer with some ice cubes in. This is stunning. Firstly, I love the shape of these tumblers. I think they're really nice to hold and they're really beautiful. But yeah, it's the same design and oh, it's really pretty. Oh, there's a part of me that should have got the whole set of these. These are really nice. <laughs> I will say the only letdown of these mugs and glasses are that they are not microwave or dishwasher safe, which for me is a pretty big negative because I dishwash 
everything. Um, <laughs> I know it's not the end of the world, I can absolutely hand wash these, but for me, that is something that would maybe put me off buying them if I had known. But either way, they are absolutely stunning. Am I gonna use these in the summer? Yes, I am. So let's stick with the tumblers. This one should be the Severus Snape tumbler. Oh, doesn't that look nice with all the lilies around? Like even before seeing Snape, the glass looks really lovely with all the flowers at the bottom. Yep, so exactly the same as the mug, but really nice. Oh, it's got even more serpents at the top and they go all the way around, which is really nice. But yeah, beautiful shape. Definitely gonna give these a little bit of a wash before using them, just not in my dishwasher. Right, next we have got one more little packet of things. And I'm not sure what's in here, but it's bubble wrapped. I'm guessing this might be more stuff from the Harry Potter gift set, maybe? I think it might be. Let's unfurl. What do we have in here? Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Let's take a look at these one at a time. So first things first, we've got some enamel pins of Harry and Hedwig. And they are singular clasped at the back. But yeah, you get two pins on there in this kind of Yumi anime style. We also get a holographic, which I really like actually, that's really magical, a holographic Harry and Hedwig pin badge. So it's pretty cool, look nice on a bag. Look at that holographic, like, yes. Ooh, so pretty and rainbowy. Oh, I didn't know that we got this. This is cute, this is a keyring. This is a really chunky keyring as well. It has this kind of bar that says Harry Potter and it's got a little gem at the end in that kind of powder blue. But this is like a really thick kind of token on a really nice chunky keyring, which is quite cool. I like that, I wasn't expecting that. And oh, got a Snape one as well. But that's cute, We've got a silver star one. And this says Severus Snape. And then the little diamond for his is black, of course. And just to check if there was anything on the back, there is not, they've just got the trademark things. But this is a really lovely keyring. I think those are really nice. And they don't feel like there would be something that would break quite easily. I have bought some official keyrings before. The one in mind that I have is the Time Turner and I think Slughorn's Hourglass. Those broke quite quickly and the I had like a flying key one as well. I think the sturdier the better when it comes to key rings and that kind of thing. But yeah, so we got two key rings. I do believe that that is everything that I ordered. And then this little support card if you need any help with any of your items in case anything turned up broken or you want to return things. But let's take a quick look at everything that I had in this order. So here is my haul overall and I do think I'm really excited about the mugs and the glasses. They're gonna look great in my kitchen. The fan, I've always been a f I've always been a fan of fans but these ones are like really good and the fact that it comes with a little slip case as well I think it's a really cute design to have on them so I approve of the fans I really like those and of course the notebooks you can never have too many notebooks now of course there is a lot more to this collection on the Harry Potter shop website but these are the pieces that I personally picked for me let me know what you think of this style this collection what you liked what you disliked are you excited for the Warner Brothers Studio Tour Tokyo, are you going to pay a visit? Because it's absolutely on my bucket list. I've never been to Japan before, but I know that that's gonna be one of the main reasons that I get my butt over to Tokyo, because I just know it's gonna be so good. Don't even get me started on the gift shops that they're going to have. I'm gonna need to take like five suitcases with me, guys. Anyway, thank you so much for watching my first look of the Yumi collection from Harry Potter. Leave a comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you got this far, because that means that I'm gonna give you 10 points to your Hogwarts house. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you soon in a next video. Bye! Right, gotta go hand wash me mugs. Gotta put them on my mug tree. And look, super cute.
Oh, might have to get more of these fans. 